welcome back to my channel today i'm super excited because i'm going to be showing you how i cover up my stretch mark if you guys haven't seen yet i do i'm covered up in stretch mark you guys and these are not new stretch marks these stretch marks are actually when i was really really young around when i was 12 but i really really like developed i don't know how to say that like all hit puberty super super quick you guys which is kind of scary anyway you guys so today i'm actually going to be showing you how i cover up my stretch mark as you can see you guys i do have stretch mark here on my shoulders which is one of my major concerns because i literally cannot wear like anything that doesn't come concern me like anything off the shoulder is like oh my god my stretch mark man and i know it's nothing to it's nothing to be ashamed of you guys we all literally we all have it it has nothing to do with you being fat it has nothing with you being like overeating or anything like that i have my sister which she's super super skinny and she has stretch mark and just literally your body like once is developing and you start scratching or if you you have super sensitive skin i also can happen like but i know i do know that i do have them and they're they're not going anywhere honey they're not going anywhere so the only option that you might have is laser treatments but it's not gonna completely like get rid of them or you can cover them up with makeup duh so let's go ahead and do that so one of the first thing I like to do is actually prime it's literally almost as if you want to have a base almost as when you're doing your foundation as well like that's kind of the steps that I do want you're going to be doing here um, so I'm just gonna be showing you here where I have the most um, how you cover them up as you can see when direct light hits them it's kind of like white but then when there is shadows like you can kind of see how they're like all the stretch marks there and it's kind of so like oh my god so annoying like i really don't care about them but i just want to show you guys in case you're you know wondering how come how to cover them up so the first thing you want to do obviously is apply some primer just so to ensure that everything's going to take stay there longer so so what i'm using actually the veil primer from hourglass i'm gonna put a little tiny I'm just gonna put a little tiny bit once again you guys just want to go and do the same process as if you were applying foundation type thing because you want to ensure this little bitch is going to stay there i do not recommend to be honest um like when wearing white things just because most likely that shit is gonna rub off all over your white dress or gown or anything like that like if it's all the shoulder like this that's not gonna like get in between clothes um so i'm just gonna go ahead and apply they're really annoying me like so much you can kind of see it when they hit shadow it's like when they're like pop out even more you can kind of see them i have applied the primer okay next we're going to apply the concealer that's going to cover up our life our entire life you guys i'm going to be using the it cosmetic bye bye under eye concealer i highly recommend for you guys to get a shade similar to your skin color just because that will look more natural so first of all this is way lighter than my skin tone which it kind of sucks but it's the only concealer that's very very full coverage and i love so much um that covers up everything <laughs> so i'm just gonna apply a bit of it um I'm just gonna start covering it up literally i'm just gonna apply little by little i'm gonna show you guys the step that i do like just little by little just little dots Um, I do like to blend it in with my finger. I just feel like I get more coverage like that And that's what we're looking for like to to get a lot of coverage But you guys can see that you can see like my stretch mark and so so I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that in with my finger Like this thing is insanely like it covers up so amazing As you can guys see like it literally just took it like it literally just erased everything I'm just gonna go ahead and keep blending obviously that looks way lighter than my older shoulder like it looks just uneven So I'm gonna go ahead and take a foundation that's the color of my skin and blend it over and for that I'm gonna be taking this Haley's foundation, which is a very high coverage foundation um, And it lasts all day long So I'm gonna apply a little bit of that and blend it into the skin as well and more on the yellow tone so i'm gonna blend that in bro like i literally have no stretch work anymore like that that's fucking insane but as you can see it's so minimal now oh my god something that's on my eye but as you can see you guys like literally you barely nothing i'm gonna show you a before and after you can see the before and after literally this is freaking bomb of course you want to go ahead and set it um just to ensure that everything is cemented and nothing's going to move around so let's go ahead and do that i love to use this translucent powder by airspawn it's super cheap and affordable so uh I highly recommend it and instead of dusting it around i'm actually going to press it in just so to ensure everything is like very set like i'm just pressing it blending it in but pressing it in and you guys it literally looks like your skin like you don't have anything literally you would not tell that i have foundation on i don't i just look dirty and uneven like look at that bitch i have a new shoulder mm -hmm. honey i could pose this i know <laughs> But as 
stick it to you guys I cover both sides so you guys can get an idea on how it will look or something like that um, I know I did it kind of quick and easy uh, just because I want to show you a little demo I honestly not going anywhere so I don't really need to do this I'm probably gonna be home the whole day just with my pee face like always but um, I hope really hope really hope you guys enjoyed this um, in case you're wondering how to cover up stretch mark or anything like that I also do not be ashamed of these little bitches they're nothing girl they do not make you honey okay do not be ashamed of them I be rocking my shit either way like when off literally I never go out like this like I, who has time for this honey tell me please who no no but I really wanted to give you an option just in case you're very very self-conscious because I know these things could get to us sometimes and it gets to me so let's be honest but uh, don't be ashamed you guys you cannot be ashamed of probably 90% of females have this shit like literally like this is part of us this is part of who we are growing and all that good stuff but anyways thank you guys so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe and also a thumbs up if you enjoyed this type of videos uh, without further ado I'll see you on my next one